with here, Purpose and Beyond. Welcome back to the channel and to my space. Before I get started, do me a favor. Go ahead and click the subscribe button and the notification button. And also give me a thumbs up. So I'm reporting back to you guys on my progress for week five, week five progress. Currently, I'm already halfway through week six. So what happened? <laughs> I already began to have this stall on my weight loss journey for my weigh-in last week, and I was shocked to see what the scale was saying. So already having trying to have like a plateau. I had to rethink about what's happening, maybe what I was doing that was hindering my progress. And so what I actually believe was happening is that, guys, I was not having enough calories in my meal plan. And I actually got the suggested or recommended calorie count offline, but I think it was way too low, way too low for where I currently am. In addition to the fact that I do try to go and walk at least five days a week, which is taking or deducting additional calories. So basically I was starving myself. I don't want to do that. So I have readjusted my meal plan for week six because as you are currently watching this, I am already halfway through week six. So I adjusted my meal plan for this week, uh, the calorie counts that I have, and in combination with working out in order to reduce the amount of calories that to lose the two pounds per week. So I made that adjustment and I'm hoping I'm praying that that is going to be the fix that I can continue on with my journey. But I definitely think I wasn't getting in enough calories for where I currently am and that I was starving myself. So right now, um, I'm still at the same weight. The amount of pounds that I've lost, I'm still there. So nothing new to report on that. I'm hoping that at my next weigh-in for next week, at the end of week six that I will have moved the needle, started to move that needle again. So guys, that's it for my weight loss update, but I do want to show you what I had on my menu and how I prepared that. So you can watch this. Don't forget to like and subscribe and come with me on this journey so that I don't have to do this by myself. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Bye. Good morning. It is Sunday morning, week five on my weight loss journey, and I am preparing to prep my meal for the week. On my menu this week is red peppers with mushrooms and white fish. So that's what I'm going to be having. The red peppers and mushrooms are going to be my side, as well as one half of a baked sweet potato. So that's going to be my dinner meal for the week and I'm getting ready to prep that. Okay guys, I'm back. I have cleaned, pitted, and sliced the red peppers. I have my mushrooms here that have been rinsed and dried to the side. And today, this week guys, I am going to switch up on my seasonings. You know, my favorite is the steak and chop. And although it's steak and chop, I also use it on my fish. And so this week with the white fish, I am going to try this Mediterranean seasoning by Weber's. So what I have here is a little, my little bowl here with um, a little olive oil that I'm going to toss the veggies in. So I'm just going to add these. I am going to season the veggies before I put the mushrooms in and then I'll kind of toss again. So just a little bit. That's getting stuck. And that means I won't have to put as much on. All right, I'm just gonna toss this a little in the olive oil. Just so you can see that. All right, now I'm just gonna add the mushrooms. And I just did these whole mushrooms. I didn't, I'm not gonna slice them up, I'll just leave them whole as they are, so. Oops, runaway mushroom. 
season that a little bit and then just continue to toss. Okay guys, I have tossed these and this is the way that looks. It smells delicious. I can't wait to try and see what this tastes like. So right here, I just have my Pampered Chef bar pan. I love my Pampered Chef. I, I have had these things for, oh my gosh, probably 15 years. Yeah, probably 15 years, if not more. And I love my Pampered Chef uh, bar pans and my bunt pan and roasters and all of that. I just love the Pampered Chef. All right, so I'm just going to pour these. I kind of get it as flat as I can so it's not double stacked. And I am simply just going to put these in the oven at 350 and let these roast. And these are going to be the veggies that I have this week for with the uh, white fish and I'll let you see me prep that in a minute. So that's just gonna be my side veggies this week. I'm gonna keep the same bowl here. I have my fish. I had to thaw this out yesterday, so. This when I get the fish from the grocery store, I just come home and unpack it. And you can see these are at least, you know, four ounces. All right, still have a little olive oil left in that. And then what I'm gonna do is just season the same seasoning. I'm using the Mediterranean seasoning. I'm just gonna season that. And then just with my hand, I'm just gonna roll that around and season that. I have to put on a glove because one, this fish is really cold. Two, it's got the seasoning in the olive oil, so. gonna get that coated okay guys I have just taken the veggies out of the oven and they look and smell absolutely delicious so again these are gonna be my veggies for my meal for week five I'm also gonna add a half a sweet baked potato with this but um, this is the low calorie part of that veggie for my meals this week okay I I'm going to now put the fish in the oven and um, let that roast. And that's going to be my meal prep for the week. And this is how my dinner turned out. And I actually did the sweet potatoes without butter and it's delicious.